the speedback idea sprang by degrees from the fun Brown has had over the years building wild rally cars, and entering both UK events and globetrotting productions like the Paris Peking Rally, in a 20s Rolls Royce. Many years ago 60s loving Brown bought an Aston DB5 and modernized it with more power, soundproofing and better brakes. I love it, and still have it, he says, but after all that it was still a 60s car. I kept wondering how I could have a modern car with the look I liked. Under the skin the David Brown Speedback GT uses a Jaguar XKR chassis, engine and all its other significant mechanical components, but is carefully designed so virtually everything you see is unique. The interior is a celebration of wood, leather and metal details. The exterior does plenty of DB5 details better than the old original, check the finely sculpted front bumper it's as you would expect nothing is left to chance, with the Speedback GT capable of storing 243 liters of luggage with the seats up and 502 liters if you lower the rear ones. The body is made of aluminium to increase structural strength and reduce the overall weight, while there are LED headlights, performance brakes, active differential and dynamics. Inside there is a plush interior for occupants to enjoy, led by the wooden rim steering wheel dual zone climate control, soft close doors, automatic wipers, electrically folding door mirrors, parking sensors and reversing camera. Like any modern vehicle, dominating the center console is a 7.0 in touchscreen infotainment system complete with sat-nav, Bluetooth, USB connectivity and the Bowers and Wilkins audio system. However, one very special feature is a so-called picnic seat, an ingenious mechanism that springs from the flat boot floor. It's a two-person perch to please any SUV owner, except that this is a Svelte GT car. The speed